It's your boy right here on the wood wheels of Steve Deal. Check this out. Hello, welcome back again, wonderful community. In today's video, in the future, what will you become? You will be learning how to become now. Listen, successful DJs. Oh. You know, that's how it. That's how it. Especially as a beginner from scratch, there are certain things that you need to be aware of when it comes to DJing. <laughs> Just as you are now investing your time and energy to watch this video with your money as well, I believe you should have every reason to achieve something at the end of the day. Because what differentiates the poor from the rich is the rich understand that they need to invest money and time and effort in certain things, and when they do that, they quickly begin to invest that energy into practical implementation while the poor at the end of the day will keep roaming around hoping that everything will be 100 percent then at the end of the day time is gone then everyone begin to feel that energy i'm putting is not worth it so we are going to see everything in this particular video and just as the last video said how to become successful with that investment in this very point you get to see how your investment will take you to for you to become successful there are certain things you need to be aware of so we are going to be starting with them in detail so here is the title of the video how to become a successful dj from scratch yes from scratch look at it beginner guide so whether you're already serving dj or you are just coming up or you are just starting you need to ask yourself as you invest this your time even to just watch this video you need to understand that you need to ask yourself what is your definition of your own success is it just watch the video and go but the bitter truth here is you need to have something defined in mind it should be either you want to be famous at the end of the day or after being famous you want to really make a lot of money and at the end of the day you'll be very comfortable and happy that you take the decision that you are taking now to watch this video or even going for a dj academy or whatsoever training session you are going for so before you're able to get this things achieved there are certain things you need to be aware of you need to know that you are going to be building a career path around dj yes this career path involves certain things that you need to be aware of you need to know your responsibility as a dj and what you are getting yourself into you need to know that as a dj you are becoming an entertainer and a promoter and also a marketer so you want to build a brand for yourself and in building that brand for yourself you need to take a certain decision whether you want to be a street dj a radio dj a club dj or a party dj look at all this so irrespective of the part you are picking or a combination of two or three that you want to work with there are other ones that i wouldn't want to go into because i don't really want to complicate things for you because at a beginner level this is a very very important for you because before you become successful you need to be aware that you are going to be looking at the business side of what you are doing yes it's a business choice just as in content creation or anything on this internet space if you cannot see the business side of what you are doing please just forget about it that's the bitter truth because while you are training yourself to become aware of what you are doing and become better in it the primary role is you want to provide high value to people that are going to get it get this value from you too as an entertainer so that means there is a particular way you need to put in that effort to get these people from the beginning how do you get your clients from the beginning we are going to be looking at it as time goes on then this success we involve getting training information and the rest of them just as i'm giving you now on this particular video so as you're putting in time money and effort yes we have talked about it already so you can start by becoming an apprentice with a dj who is already doing in the industry or just by going for a dj training session so if you are going for a dj training session it means you want to quickly start on your own within the shortest possible time then one thing i always advise is if before you go into the dj profession you need to understand that the dj profession is capital intensive yes it is capital intensive so since these things are capital intensive it means you need money to fund your journey in this particular part whether by your own self or by people around you so that means you need to get a source of funding that means i will always advise you start as a side hustle while you gradually build yourself get something doing that you can be getting something little to kickstart then in kickstarting this is where it is very very important because by the time you are starting nobody knows you, you need to be aware of that even if they know you they might not know your efficiency as a dj so 
they need to first give you a try there is always that first time so for them to give you that first time there are people you need to connect with this is where it is very very important you need to connect with fellow djs maybe possibly around your vicinity create awareness about yourself and then you need to identify event planners around your area there is no way you tell me that you stay in an area for a very long period of time you don't know anybody there completely you need to understand event centers event planners and the rest of them try to establish connection with them that this is what you have it's a way of marketing yes if you don't do that let me tell you nobody knows you nobody will do this for you and then you also need to identify club for those who want to become club djs you can identify them as the rest of them try to establish connection with the managers and possibly the owners tell them this is what you have for them and this is it with time they want to give you a try even hype men yes this ones are also very important hype men too are very very important then you also look at uh, the third one radio stations and the rest of that I wouldn't be i wouldn't go in detail so much this is just to give you an idea of what you should know so you have radio other radio station or, or fellow radio djs you can also give them a try you can see i'm giving you a wide scope of opportunities that you are supposed to be tapping into while you start because it's something that will grow in gradual process most of these successful djs you get to see today they follow this pattern yes that's the bitter truth that you need to be aware of so don't feel shy don't feel bad of anything you will definitely get there i guarantee you if you can follow what i'm saying in this particular video just as you have been following me from day one trust me you will definitely get there so there are people that you are going to be working with as a dj you you need to be aware of i've listed them already so these are the people you are going to be working with and you need to establish that good rapport with them because they are the people that some of them that have been there for long they might know some things that you might not know so doing that will really help you a lot to become to even get the connection that you are looking for and even sound engineers as well so sound engineers to the event you don't have or you can also go for a little sound engineering course so that you understand how sound system works because possibly you might do that during your dj training so these things are very very important for you to really build that career path that you're looking for then the next thing you look you need to look at is for you to make money in the dj industry while you are performing at events which you popularly call gigs or as a radio presenter or as whatever uh, platform you want to work with you need to understand that you are going to be promoting you play the role of brand ambassador to a large extent yes for some cases depending on as you grow as you get to a certain stage you also need to understand that you are going to be providing entertainment at events through music as you get to do so this is one interesting part again that you need to be aware of so so that you don't just be whiling away your time and not just getting anything in return at the end of the day then building your brand and popularity this is where when you get to a certain stage there are other things you are going to be exploring i wouldn't be saying that in this particular video yet because you some of you must have seen me do that but don't worry with time i'm going to give you those tips and other platform on how you can go about it so it's a gradual process for now just work with what we have here and i believe at the end of the day you have every reason to be appreciative that you came across this channel here we build people that will become not just brand within their own local community but trust me if you can follow what i'm doing in this particular channel you become a global brand within some couple of years to come it's not it will not happen overnight but i uh, trust me you will definitely get there so i believe you will learn something in this particular video as i continue to bring more don't forget to keep a date as i continue to build more and if you are just coming across the channel for the first time don't forget to subscribe and catch you in my next video thank you very much for being there don't give up continue to push as we continue to put in more effort here to give you this high value that you are getting so catch in my next video once again if you haven't watched the previous video on how to start with zero investment maybe you can check that video you get to see the difference between what this very video and the other video so thank you once again for being there okay okay, okay. Bye. Bye.